Hi everyone, it's Eva here again. Uh, I would like to share with you just very quick and easy project how to make your shelving very cheap <laughs> if you can find some which will fit in your empty space. As I had this problem, I couldn't find some good shelf for my uh, really fast growing storage uh, stuff. So I had to make it up and uh, I've got few I've got 12, I think, boxes like this. And as you can see, they are not strong enough, but they are really good. They can uh, handle around 15 kilos, I think. So, because I have access to those, uh, they are called pallet corners, and those um, chipboard corners are using when pallets uh, with items on it are wrapping with that uh, clear film. So those uh, corners, they are very long, you can see that here. Those corners are using for uh, saving uh, those goodies on the pallet. So if you have access to the, those corners, you can make very strong and really good shelving. As you can see here, here I made my own shelf. And you can make it in any shape you want, in any shape you need. I made it in front of my <laughs> heating because it was there free space. And I need to put all those goodies somewhere. <laughs> so I made this shelving and it's really strong. It's not moving at all and it's keeping, as you can see, it's keeping loads of goodies inside. So it's just very short advice when you will try to stick those uh, boxes together and you will have those corners just put them uh, on size which you need as you you see here i used one uh, between boxes and one long always one long to put together two boxes and on the bottom i try to make as long uh, to stick as long this corner as i could because this, if you will keep those corners, those basic corners on the top and on the bottom uh, in one piece, it will make strong your shelf. So don't cut them for this size, leave them for how long size you will find, yeah? And their extent like I did here, because I've got only one, one and I think one meter and 20 centimeters is this, this corner so I have to extend it for a little bit so try to keep them as long as you will find and then first which you will stick on a box it will be that piece which you want to hide so here here is one <laughs> very small in black because that other side of my room is in black color so I have to <laughs> made it in black <laughs> It's not finished yet, and first I thought that I'm going to do just this, but now I'm going to extend it. So first I will put those corners on this side. Ah, this is long one. No, this is wrong one. Ah, uh -huh. <laughs> this, <laughs> this one. I will stick this or glue this and this, and then I will cover. Those corners uh, on the top and on the bottom together with the second shelf and it will make it stronger and of course before I will glue this one that's this last one I have to glue this box to that uh, shelving and then I will put this long corner and it's look really good and it's pretty strong and it's very cheap <laughs> So here is my shelving <laughs> and it's a really long one <laughs> and I decorated it by my stencils here and here because I wanted to make it pretty you know and here I try to make <laughs> one more decoration <laughs> oh no this way here you can see that <laughs> so this is my shelving hopefully it will help you hopefully you will like it and you will Take it like useful.
Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.